Good morning to all. Today we are going to start our lab session. So I will teach you, as I said yesterday, step number one. What is the step number one? The solution. Please. So we collect mushroom from the from uh, uh, natural habitats. So after that, we should bring that mushroom to this laboratory. And we are going to take pure cultures. So this process we call isolation. So there are several techniques we can do for isolation, but remember it depends on the mushroom that you are going to isolate because different kind of mushrooms you are using different kind of isolation methods for an example <coughs> are using tissue culture technique in this technique we will take a sterile tissue from the middle part of the mushroom and manipulate it with the petri dishes with media so the the second technique is a spot dropping method. We will drop the spores directly onto the uh, onto the petri plate inside the sterile environment, inside the laminar flow. So you can prepare media with the petri plate inside the media, and then you can attach the small tissue on the top of the the other lid. So then. After few hours, then the spores will drop into the meat and cover it and then keep it like this. Then the attached tissue will drop the spores onto the media and those spores can make pure culture. So how can you attach that attach that small tissue onto tissue to here? So you can add, uh, you can apply some little Vaseline to here and then stick the small tissue inside the top part of the petri dish and then close it you can leave it inside the laminar flow for a few hours or laminar flow or somewhere else then the, the tissue will drop spores and those spores will germinate and make pure culture but remember don't keep it for a long time because this tissue we collected from the natural habitat it has some kind of uh, other other uh, uh, bacteria and other fungus so if you keep for a long time those fungus will uh, grow on media so therefore don't keep it more than one or two hours then remove the top part and then after that you can cover with another new sterile petri dish and keep it inside the incubator to grow the spores If you have a, a mushroom with a cap, so what I did inside the laminar flow, I will make a small stand and keep the petri plate here and cut the. This is the part of the uh, mushroom under that have a, a spores. So I cut this uh, cap. And keep on this here. So then, after one hour, the spores will drop into this medium. Then, after one hour, you can take it out and cover with the new top plates and keep inside incubation. So that is a method, spore dropping method, we usually follow for getting pure cultures. <laughs> 